We will be talking about the drug ephedrine, including the uses and side effects of it and why it was banned by the FDA. Ephedrine is the involuntary nervous system stimulant. The main ingredient of ephedrine is ephedra, or ma huang, which is the Chinese pronunciation of it. The drug classification of ephedrine is sympathomimetic, which means that it mimics the effects of the sympathetic nervous system, which is one of the two main divisions of the autonomic nervous system, with the other one being parasympathetic. The pharmacodynamics of the drug ephedrine, or what the drug does on the body, is its indirect and direct actions on the adrenergic receptor systems, which is part of the sympathetic nervous system. Common uses of ephedrine include treating the cold symptoms of the cold and flu, asthma, bronchitis, and allergies. It also increases the, ener the energy in athletes which increases performance in athletes and is also very popular among bodybuilders because of its strong thermogenic quality. It works by elevating basal met metabolic rate, thereby increasing energy expenditure and resulting in fat loss. The drug ephedrine is a decongestant and bronchodilator, which means that it reduces inflammation and constricting blood vessels in the nasal passages and widens the lung airways. This decreases the resistance of air in the respiratory airways and increases airflow to the lungs, which is why it is used for treating the symptoms of cold, flu, asthma, and bronchitis. The common side effects of ephedrine usually include arousal of the autonomic nervous system or having an autonomic hyperactivity, which includes symptoms of anxiety, mood disturbances, Heart palpitations, which means increase in heart rate, or heart arrhythmia, which is an irregular heartbeat, insomnia, nausea, and sweating. More serious side effects include heart attack, stroke, seizures, and death. Keep in mind that these symptoms have been seen while using ephedrine. It is usually seen that the person has pre-existing problems with heart attack, stroke, or seizures, and ephedrine is not the, the direct cause of it. Ephedrine is still available in the U.S. as a non-prescription medication for relief of breathing problems such as asthma and bronchitis. You should not use the drug ephedrine if you're in, um, experiencing the symptoms of chest pain, irregular heartbeat, have had a history of heart attacks, mental or mood disorders, circulation problems, movement disorders, overactive thyroid, or glaucoma. We are against the recreational use of this drug. Any products that contain ephedra was banned by the FDA in 2004 because of its unreasonable risks to those who use it. Based on a report published by the Rand Institute, ephedra containing dietary supplements have been linked to 16,000 adverse effects. Ephedrine is a banned from most sport governing bodies, including the International Olympic Committee.